Former Chief Secretary to the Government, Tan Sri Dr. Ali Hamsa has denied threats were made against the then Auditor General, Tan Sri Amrin Wang, to amend the audit report on the One Malaysia Development Berhad, 1MDB. Ali said neither him or former 1MDB CEO, Arul Kanda Kandasamy, had ever pressured Amrin to tamper with the audit report. He said this during a cross-examination by lawyer Tan Sri Muhammad Shafi'i Abdullah in the joint trial of Datuk Sri Najib Raza and Arul Kanda on Tuesday. The witness testified he was called for a meeting on February 24th in 2016 as per Najib's instruction stating that the former Prime Minister was not satisfied with the draft report's contents. He, however, agreed with Shafi's suggestion that the meeting was called to expunge several issues, among which was the existence of two conflicting 1MDB financial statements for the year 2014 and regarding the presence of fugitive businessman Lotek Joe, or also known as Joe Lo, in a 1MDB meeting. Ali said after the meeting, Amrin appeared normal and was not upset. Another witness who testified, Audit Director Nur Salwani Mohammad, said her boss Amrin appeared upset after the meeting with what had transpired during the discussion. Najib is accused of using his position to order amendments to the 1MDB final audit report before it was tabled to the PAC to avoid any action against him. He allegedly committed the offence in Putrajaya between February 22 and 26, 2016. Arul Kanda has been charged with abetting Najib at the same place and time. The hearing before Justice Muhammad Zaini Mazlan continues on Wednesday.